Hi there guys, my name is Samuel and today we shall be taking a look at set 40418 Falcon and Black Widow team up which is from the Marvel 2020 summer line and it is £13.49 but £13.50 and £14.99 in um, euros and um, dollars but um, just I just say 15 because I don't know, I just round them up. So this comes in the blister packaging and as you can see it has four minifigures and it also contains 60 pieces. And can I just say, this is an amazing set. You get two AIM agents, which I get, I'm on the side that really love them. I think they're great minifigures for army builders. They, like, the detail on them is amazing for an army builder. So that is amazing. Then Black Widow is a repeat, sadly, but Falcon more than makes up with it he's an amazing figure and the cannon is a pretty nice inclusion too so here are the two aim agents that are included and wow i do love the detailing you can see all the stripes on their body which just look so good like um yeah i don't really know what to say about them they just look amazing like you got all their bags and packs and body armor and um yeah they just look really awesome then you can see the face print here, so they are identical with the um, gas mask, which is really cool. And from the back, they look amazing as well. And they are they are the same colour. I know the lighting's a bit off on some reason, but um, yeah, they are absolutely amazing. Like the like, I don't know, just the quality and the printing, I would say, is pretty amazing considering they're just army builders. And um, I hope that they do a two a two man blister pack. It'd be really cool if it was like. I don't know. Well, they, I, I guess it would have to be like eight or nine pounds. But no, I, it would be amazing, right? If they could do like a five pound, six pound set with just two of these. Like that, like not even a build. Well, I could just do a little build, but it'd be so cool just to have a couple of these. Or it could be like, it could suggest like if you could buy 10 of these, what build you could make, something like that. I think it would be an amazing idea. But yeah, these minifigures are amazing, which is just great. Here we have Black Widow, where she looked amazing. If you just, well, you know, you can just see the detail. It's absolutely amazing what they've managed to capture here. It's just and it's just amazing. Like, I don't really know what else to say. It's just absolutely amazing. Then she has some arm printing on each side, which is amazing. Like, they barely do it in a £100 set. So, let alone for a £13.50 set. It's amazing. And look, she has a little wrist um, electrocute things. Oh, I, d I literally only just realised she had them on both arms. <laughs> but, yeah, it's a disappointing. It is... Um, same as one of the others, but it is fine. And there is actually a um, torso detailing difference. I didn't even know that from the Black Widow set one. And if we take this off, you can see her face print there and where there. And she also uses the like the wands piece, but the shorter version. And that is also the back printing, which is just um I don't know. It's just amazing to be honest. I when I look at the back printing, it to it could actually it kind of looks like a. Iron Man suit, like a Black Widow one, which, um, oh, that could be so cool if they did that. But yeah, that looks amazing. A great minifigure. Shame that she's in so many sets. It would have been cool to get. Even if it made no sense, but do the white one from her movie that hopefully will be coming out soon. But yeah, I think that is awesome. And here we have Falcon. And wow, it's amazing. I love the fact that it's kind of a mesh of the new and the old, like, the newer iterations in the movies, he has armor. Then in the comics, he's got more of the um, spandex kind of costume. And here is both, which I think it looks amazing. Just looking at the body detailing, it is amazing. You can see just all these like, different shades of red, the white, the gold. It, I don't know, it just blends in so well. The wings, um, I don't think we've ever had perfect wings. Um, looking back at the other ones... Um, I don't, I just don't think that we've ever had perfect wings. No, not really. So that's a shame. But yeah, I think this is an amazing minifigure though. Here is the back. Yeah, the back looks even worse. And he's got that pack, which is even ama more amazing, this clip. They never ever do clips in like accurate colours that actually make sense. And sometimes that makes... Um, things look out of place. I know the Hulk Buster, like the pins in his shoulder pads are just blue and it makes no sense, which, yeah, it kind of put me off, but then 
kind of got to go back and get it at some point because Marvel Collector and all of that. But um, yeah, that's kind of uh, what I think is also good. And if we have a look at the head, a funny pattern that um, I've heard people point out, and I've kind of I've noticed it the more I look. If you look at their face, look, their facial printings look so similar. Like, they're obviously not completely the same, but then they kind of got things that are similar. Then you've got the frowning, and just look at the mouth. Like, the mouth kind of looks really similar, which is really interesting. I know it isn't, but um, it's kind of just an interesting detail that sort of resembles, maybe. So, you two actually could get away with using that neck, Nick head as a Falcon without his goggles, which is awesome. And here is his wing pack which is also really awesome, like the detailing of where it connects and stuff. So yeah, I think that is amazing. But um, I think this should have been done in white, the black piece here, because it kind of blends more in with the suit or maybe bread. But yeah, I think that's really awesome. And if you already weren't sold enough on the set, they give you a little cannon to fire your figures at, uh, no, to fire at your figures. And yeah, he just looks really neat. Like I've got to admit, it looks cool. You've got the... um. Technic wheel, you've got that big base plate, then yeah, just looking at it, it's nothing um nothing special, but it's still a great little you know inclusion, and you know how those work when you spin them and they fire off. But yeah, I think guys, that is it for this little review. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, what do I think of this set? I think it is amazing, as you've probably heard me kind of um say. But yeah, um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. It is an amazing little set for the price. I think it's great. And uh, yeah, I think any kids of any age or anyone a collector, you would enjoy it. If you like what you see here, you really can't get wrong. The canon is great and everything about it is great. And yeah, so that's what I think of it. Thank you for watching this video. And until tomorrow's video, bye for now.